Thank you, Detective. I think I have it from here. All right. Get some rest, Chastity. Thank you so much. I'll try. <laughs> Thank you. Leaving the hospital now. Be home soon. I didn't leave it open. Where's your boy Roger now? Oh, ow. Your leg's broken. I mean, it looks broken. Another way to put it is you broke my leg. It didn't have to come to this, Chastity. It didn't come to this. You brought it to this. And what choice did you give me? Huh? You just shut it all down. Everything. I love you. Then why are you hurting me? You hurt me. Yeah, I did some bad things, I know. But I'm a good person. You didn't even give me a chance. What are you gonna do, shoot me? I don't know, maybe I should. I just have this... this anger inside me. I don't know what to do with. Okay. You know, it was better when I was with you. Do you know that? Xavier, I want to help you. I do. <laughs> well, that's sweet. But it's a little late for that now, Chastity. You did this. You brought out this wrath. Now you're gonna pay. She's still not here? What time is it? She should have been here two hours ago. I don't know why she hasn't called me. She knows I worry. Let's call her again. Okay. We'll call the detective. I said I'm sorry. Congratulations. Don't you have to forgive me? Why do I have to forgive you for something you did to someone else? Where do you get your rules? The agnostic's guide to Christianity? She is not late because she's visiting a friend. I know. I just have to explore all possibilities. Nobody's seen her, Sam. We've called everybody we know. Is it possible she changed her mind and made the last ferry? Drove herself back to the city? She told me she was coming straight home from the hospital. OK, I don't want the two of you to work yourselves up too much. We have patrol cars out there looking. We'll find her. 